Hi everyone, thank you for tuning in and welcome to the Kedron factory. So today we're gonna to have a run through Deb and Ricky's brand new 20 foot six Kedron XC5. So this one here features an island queen bed at the front of the van. In the center, it has a larger cafe dinette that is opposite the kitchen area. And then at the rear has the full separate shower toilet ensuite. So we'll have a quick run through the van so Deb and Ricky can head off for their test tow. So this one here, as we say, is riding on the Kedron KRS suspension, so unique for the Kedron owners. And stepping inside the van, you can see the size of that cafe dinette. So Deb and Ricky have increased that. So when that table drops, that makes a nice size additional bed. So that drops down with an infill cushion that goes in and converts that to the second bed. Plenty of overhead cupboard space wrapping all the way around over the bed at the front, above that cafe dinette also nice deep cupboards, full height stainless steel piano hinge and those marine grade push twist catches. And then swiveling back around to the kitchen area, that black glass sink complements in with that black splashback. And then down into that marble look in the laminate. Complements off very nicely indeed to that stained American oak hardwood trim. And then wraps down to that black or that charcoal, metallic charcoal in the face of those pull out drawers and cupboards underneath for more storage. To the right of this is the fan forced oven in the Tetford, so it has a separate griller. Up top has three gas and one 240 element as well. Above this is some welcome chockies and bubbles. A little bit of a personalized gift there from Ricky inside the van for Deb. So up top here is the microwave. Next to that inside is the mobile phone booster that emits out here to increase the signal of a mobile phone signal outside if you wish to do so. And then to the right of this is the electronics heartland inside. So the controller here for the aircon and the hot water, the CD, USB and Bluetooth player next to that. Below this are the readouts for the 300 amp lithium power pack state of charge, the power going in, the water tank level indicators, and then the temperature of the electrical cabinet outside. Below that again are the controllers for the inverter charger combi unit, and then the press button circuit resetters either side of this. This one has the automatic tracking sat dish, so press button, lifts up, swivels around and automatically locks in the satellites for the sat TV. Forward of this is the TV DVD here that swivels back to that cafe dinette as well as to the bed itself. So the Island Queen bed features a locally made bamboo pocket spring mattress, so really nice and comfortable. This lifts up and it's sitting on a slatted bed base so that allows more comfort plus it allows that mattress to breathe. That is the infill cushion here for making that cafe dinette into a bed, a linen recess and then twin pull out drawers underneath that. Above this is a nice large window at the front of the van. Above there is the gas code reverse in out fan variable speed. And then also has the twin windows either side, so the slimline windows. Twin fans, one either side of the bed as well as one above that cafe dinette. You can see the size of that cafe dinette's table from here. So larger amount of dining space as well as you might want to put, play card games or board games. Or pop a laptop on there and send some photos to your family and friends as you travel around. Large window above that to take in the view and ventilation when it suits to do so. In between the cafe dinette and that fridge freezer is a three shelf pantry. Full height in the stainless steel piano hinge, as well as those marine grade catches there that push and twist for a positive lock. Three pull out drawers underneath. And then this one here has that two door compressor fridge freezer and then the full height in that entrance door being mirror space. So it opens the van up, 
gives a nice roomy feel and then also if you're heading out for dinner for the night you can check yourself out before you head out entering into the ensuite you can see the amount of storage there next to that cassette toilet ceramic oval bowl sink there with the flick mixer tap more mirror space more storage above and that wall mount of washing machine here more window space in the ensuite then the recessed towel rail holders recessed toilet roll holder soft blue night light and then a second outlet for the diesel heater to keep things warm inside your ensuite opening up and entering into the shower our in-house made aluminium slip and crack resistant shower base it's all locally powder coated aluminium dye bond in the walls there as well as the shampoo and shower gel dispenser shower head more led lighting and then the additional vent space up top here is the filtered compression hatch so that's design registered unique for the kedron owners with the ability for internal access to that australian made filter so when you're traveling on dirt roads you simply turn that on that will pressure inside the van with filtered air and then when you need to do so you can access that from inside the van and then wash it dry it and put it back in so great feature there next to this is the aluminium dye bond in the ceiling above that is the thermo block australian made non-toxic insulation into the walls themselves is the australian made thermo block insulation in the dual foil so has also the interlocked aluminium frame with the high tensile steel pin punches so that secures that frame together and gives a beautiful longevity and strength in the frame so we've got a van over there would be nearly 55 60 years old with the aluminium frame and just the longevity of that way of construction in the build is why we build the Kedrons like that today all right we might pop out to the outside of the van and have a quick overview and then we will take deb and ricky for their test tow hitched up to the ever popular lc 200 there so the 200 series land cruiser just looking at the front of the van here has the weight distribution bars fitted up this one has the do 45 in the head electric front jack padded cover we make in house to keep that nice and protected from the elements also a plate aluminium locally powder coated front box as part of the gas code there ventilated out underneath access port to turn your bottles on and off stainless straps lock in twin 10 litre jerrys diesel heater is in set inside that front boot with a lockable diesel filler there as well more storage up top front protection scrub plates pull out storage box here with the barbecue provision or a portable barbecue provision inset is that steel encased 300 amp lithium power pack behind that is the led keyless drop table the tv provisions there got the kedron punch in that aluminium die bond gives it a nice finish goodyear wrangler duratrax so the flagship tire for goodyear on the kedrons here that hot dip galvanized chassis here Kedron KRS suspension so this one here has the unique Kedron KRS suspension all been physically ram tested at the government approved facility and it has coil spring with drum brakes forward of this are the Kedron unique water tank so internally strengthened food grade made here in Queensland baffled also for that nice stable tow so the stability in tow that these assist with so that limits the water from sloshing left to right and aids in that nice stability when you are on the highway especially stepping back out we will just walk around the back of the van and then we will pack down and go for a test tow with deb and ricky in between the twin spare wheels on the rear is the outside shower and then wrapping around to this side the access point to that cassette toilet the instant hot water the gray water tank outlet there another led keyless drop table and then in front of this are the electronics so the heartland on the outside so that has that inverter charger on the right and then a raft of the electronics 
So this is all protected with those dust prevention buttons when they are pressed and closed off. Inside there has a thermostat controlled fan to keep things cool and a red isolation switch. So when Rick and Deb store this van, they can shut that off and keep that 300 amp lithium power pack all isolated. Certainly a beautiful package there. A lot of people's dream package to be able to head off around Australia when safe to do so. Give a little bit of an overview there of the package together. All right, all, well, we'll wrap it up so we can pack down and head off for a test tow. Again, thank you to everyone for tuning in. Thanks for all of the fantastic support. Hi to all of our great friends here in Australia and also over in America, Canada, Russia, France. We uh, get so many wonderful messages all around the world. So uh, thank you for the great support. All right, I will wrap it up here and we will wish Deb and Ricky all the very best for their third new Kedra now. A beautiful job they've done there with their layout and colours. And on behalf of the whole Gaul family and all the Kedron team here, we wish you many safe and enjoyable travels around this wonderful country of ours. Obviously, when it is safe to do so. To everyone else, thank you for tuning in. All right, all, I will wrap it up. Deb and Ricky, we might catch you on the track someday. If not, we might catch up with everyone on the next walkthrough. Cheers, everyone. Thanks again. Stay safe and all the very best. Cheers for now.